In this video, I'll show you how to permanently add subtitles to a video using WinX HD Video Converter. Welcome to this video. My name is David and you need two things to do this. Okay, basically three things. You need WinX HD Video Converter and you can check it out from the link below. Number two, you need the video that you're going to be burning the subtitles to and obviously you need the subtitles that you're going to be burning to the video. So I have the application, the video and the subtitles. So let's begin. So I've already opened WinX HD Video Converter and uh, all we need to do is either add the video from here or from here. So let's just click here and you can also add the video uh, from DVD or YouTube. But let's add a local video and you'll see uh, all these things. It looks pretty basic, crystal clear, straight on. Just click on that. And from that, you'll need to navigate to the folder with the video that you want to burn subtitles to. So let's select that and then click on open. And once we add our video, what we're going to do is that we're going to get a pop-up that shows us what output file do we want. So uh, recent, uh, there is a recently used profile. Uh, this is an MP4, which is recommended. Standard MP4 and the codecs and all that low quality that is lq and it's fast to be rendered or uh but to, to band in or converted uh but also you can slide this to a high quality video bigger size but better quality so let's say we go with that and uh, since this is a small video there's no issue so let's assume that's what we select click ok now once we click ok you'll notice that there's no subtitle so what we can do we can just click on this and then we can add an external SRT. An external SRT or an external subrip subtitle is what is required. So let's just click on that. With the recent update Once we on click the YouTube on that, interface, uh, you'll it's see, now easier than before. Uh, the video starts playing, but we don't want it to play. So uh, we can just YouTube have it at the start or YouTube uh, just basically somewhere there. Uh, and then uh, you'll see the different options from this pop-up. You enable subtitle, uh, an inner subtitle or extra. Let's just click on add and then navigate to the subtitle that we want. I have a bunch of them and I'll select the English one. Just click on that and then click on open. Uh, we'll have to add that and if you just scroll, uh, you'll see like nothing has happened and then just uh, click on apply to all. So once we do that, you'll see now that we have a subtitle. Uh, you can just see that info. You can click on edit With the reason if you wanted to make any edits to this particular video, but you don't want to do that. You can also choose to rename the file if that's something that you like. Uh, and also the settings, you can just see the settings of the particular output uh, from this particular section. You can change uh, the profiles and all that, but that's not what we want uh, to do. We just want to ban or permanently add these subtitles to this video. So if you're ready, uh, you'll notice that on the side, on the right, uh, this hardware accelerator is turned on that is uh, depending on your system, your laptop and all that, either Intel, Nvidia, AMD, whatever is available. Use high quality engine, you can do all this, but there's no need uh, to make all these things. You can also merge video files. If you had different video files that you wanted to add, uh, merge them with their, with their subtitles, that would be awesome. And then this is the destination folder. So let's just run this and see the result that we're going to get. Just click on run. It's going to actually start uh, converting our video uh, and burning in our subtitles to the video. So it's almost done. Remaining time about seven seconds. So there we go. And it's going to open the output folder. Once it's done, just click OK. It's going to open the output folder. If we just double click on it. With the recent update on the YouTube interface, post so that it's now easier than before to download this. YouTube uh, there you transcripts. Go. Hi, my name Let's just go to the start. With the recent update on the YouTube interface, it's now easier than before to download. The subtitles have been permanently added to our video. And if I just right click, go to subtitle, you'll notice that you have the option to add a subtitle. Uh, that is a sidecar and all that, but this one is permanently banned in because there are no subtitle tracks that are active. So we can just see how it looks like, uh, and it looks pretty good. It has done a pretty good
good job. That is how you can permanently add subtitles to a video using Winex HD Video Converter Deluxe. Thanks for watching this video. My name is David. I hope this video has been of value to you. Thanks for watching.